I'm, was I'm so rich, I got lawyers, I can do whatever I want. I only eat with silver spoons. Sterling silver. I hate poor people. I don't care about their struggles, I don't care about their hardships. <laughs> it's like, get out of my way. So, sterling silver. Ugh. Fuck, I'm comfortable, I'm living large. I am God, okay? Woof Bernatet Jr. The disaster struck in Tennessee. Why was the slush pond chosen to be built in Gent, Kentucky? Because it's Kentucky. <laughs> Kentucky's the perfect dumping ground. It's not like one of the important states. It's not California. It's not New York. It's just a bunch of hillbillies and river rats. They don't know any better. Uh, what if the local council votes no on a zoning change? They won't. How do you know? I just do. Um, move on. Move on to the next question. I'm not even going to answer that. What about what about the charges that the ponds that the ponds are toxic? Or duh. I mean, they're toxic. Or toxic dumps. That's toxic is in the name. There's been a lot. There's been a lot of talk about clean coal. Mm -hmm. Is it real? <laughs> no. I can't even believe people believe that. <laughs> clean coal. Clean coal is an oxymoron. It's like military intelligence or jumbo shrimp. Can I kick it? Can I kick it? Uh, but mostly Kentucky people. Like I said, hillbillies and river rats. <laughs> They're a bunch of morons. Would Eon ever turn the electricity off on a family with children? Yeah. <laughs> why, why wouldn't you? Why, like, I'm supposed to care about the community? <laughs> the community. <laughs> I don't know. I don't like the community. I don't care about the community. I'm allowed to do this. I'm allowed to say, fuck you. That's it. I just want to make money. And you're, you're acting like because a family has kids, I'm supposed to be more sympathetic. Those kids need to get out and get them some jobs. Woof, Bernatette Jr. Fuck out of here. We're going, man. Fuck this shit. Fuck you. Fuck you and Madonna. These are four suggestions from the president of the EPA. We should completely dry out the sludge pond. Uh, we should seal the ash in a landfill with a double liner of clay. There should be groundwater monitoring. And we need a collection system in case the toxins leak out. Hmm. Now a lot of you motherfuckers are going to come out. If they just came after me just because I was a citizen, now what do I think? <laughs> Gotta be careful. Solidarity forever. Nothing I know my boss is full of bills. I can't pay this stuff. I think, I think we're going to have to decide which side are you on? Which side, Kentucky, which side are you going to be on? You or, you with the working people or are you with the rich people? The rich people got plenty of friends. They got lawyers. They got monies. They got resources. They got everything that they need. Working people, all we got is ourselves, our bodies, our minds. This is it. This is what we got. I choose the working people. I also choose the working people. We're the majority. If we, if we all stop, they can't stop us all, they can't arrest us all. And if we all stop, the whole machine stops. 59% of Kentuckians graduated high school, 41% did not. 10% of Kentuckians graduated college. 76% are against the Afghan, uh, Afpac, Afghanistan, Pakistan war. And 14% support it, and 10% weren't sure. 59% uh, of Kentuckians are not in favor of the legalization of marijuana, 31% is in favor of it, and 10% uh, wasn't sure. 55% of Kentuckians are for the income tax, 41% are against it, and 4% wasn't sure. 55% of Kentuckians are for the Federal Reserve, 21 are against it, and 24% weren't sure. 62% of Kentuckians are for the death penalty, 28% were not, and 10% is not sure. Uh, the majority, over the majority, are for 
uh, are in support of the union, 66%, 14% were not, and 20% aren't sure. So, and then 79% of Kentucky's, uh, Kentuckians think that college should be free. 7% didn't, and 14% weren't sure. 1% of Kentuckians have heard about the blue people. 21% of Kentuckians drink Pepsi. 17% of Kentuckians drink Mountain Dew. 14% doesn't drink pop. 14% drinks Coke. 7% drink an alcoholic substitute instead. And 18% uh, drink something else. 59% of Kentuckians do not smoke. 41% do. It is Arlen. You were saying about this town, about how a lot of these businesses are, they're leaving. And not only, Har you said Harlan County, I mentioned Wallens Creek, but you said also Harlan they're County. They're all going to turn into a ghost well, town? coal mines, ain't nothing down there. Just a bunch of people there. See, I almost get the chance now. I almost share a little living. My dad was so far as the state brothers. His brother. He got killed with James Scroat. Zero miles of gas. They're on that flag down there too. Their names. Oh, right there in the front, front of it. the flag. Yeah. How many wives you got? <laughs> uh, none. None. Well, you don't see Don't see Huh? I want to you're kind of sending a mixed message. You got a Kentucky hat and an Ohio shirt. Which one are you more? You like a big Kentucky fan or Ohio fan? Kentucky fan. Nice, huge. Nice boys. Got this pop for a So when you analyze all these numbers, uh, what it comes up to is uh, most people haven't heard about the blue people. Most people are not smokers. Most Kentuckians prefer uh, Pepsi and Mountain Dew to all other drinks. A little bit more Pepsi than Mountain Dew. Uh, but the combined total is 38%, so that's over a, a one out of three people drinking Pepsi products. Uh, most people think that most Kentuckians think that college should be free. Most Kentuckians are for unions. Uh, most Kentuckians are for the death penalty. Most Kentuckians are for the Federal Reserve. Most Kentuckians are for the income tax. Most Kentuckians are not in favor of the legalization of marijuana. Most Kentuckians are against the Afghanistan Pakistan war. Uh, most Kentuckians have not graduated college. Only 10% have and most Kentuckians have graduated high school. Uh, about equal on the Patriot Act, one-third support it, one-third didn't, and the other um, third wasn't sure. Most Kentuckians have, uh, d most Kentuckians do not have dental insurance, uh, but most Kentuckians have health insurance. And most Kentuckians are in favor of universal health care. Um, and most Kentuckians